Well met, everybody. Welcome back to Moonshadow Fantasy. I am your host, Makarios Moonshadow, a.k.a. Maka. Special shout-out to my static team. I am making this video for you and for everybody out there who is having trouble with these harvests. Especially you, Party Finder. Don't know your left from right. Moving on. The very first harvest is Famine. What you want to do here is pre-position yourselves and head towards the platform where only two siege dropped. The other platforms will have three. And what we're doing here is if you do not have a tether, you're going to go to the platform with the two seeds and bait the Minotaur's AoEs outwards and then immediately stand behind them. Everyone else that has a tether, you're simply going to go to the opposite platform and the opposite side of your Minotaur. So for example, if you're tethered to a Minotaur on the bottom left, you're going to go to the top right. If you're tethered to the top left, you're going to go to the bottom right. Now let's see all that again, but in slow-mo. So once the boss begins casting Famine Harvest, you want to look for the platform that only has the two seats. All the other platforms will have three. Pre-position yourselves by going to the two-seated platform, and those without a tether are going to bait the AoEs from these two Minotaurs by standing on the yellow markers, the two or the B. The second you see those AoEs from the Minotaurs immediately move to behind either one of them to dodge the bird AoEs and the AoEs from the Minotaurs. Everyone else who has a tethered attached to them to a Minotaur simply move to the opposite platform on the opposite side behind those Minotaurs. Moving on to Death Harvest. So welcome to Death Harvest, aka Bull South, and the bane of your party finder existence. We're going to clarify all this up right here, right now. What you want to do is you want to first find the platform with the bull's egg or seed that's in the middle of a platform. That is your new true north. Now, the tanks and healers will be tethered to a different bull, and the DPSs will be tethered to a different bull. The bull directly south of that new true north, that's the bull south strat, and the DPSs are going to split as well as the healers, into Team 1 and to Team 2. Team 1 is always on the bull's left, and Team 2 the bull's right. And that's where Party Finder gets it messed up and confused because they don't go to the bull's left and the bull's right. The tanks remain on the... Now, the, the seed that, the, uh, that dropped on the bull's platform, that's a no-no zone. So the only thing the tanks need to do is whether you're stacked, uh, you, you do want to stack together, you don't want to be too spread apart, shields up, but you're just going to be on the opposite bridge, um, away from your fellow teammates, adjacent from the bull that you're tethered to. The healers and the DPSs are going to go to the bull's correct side on the other platforms, team one on the left, team two on the right. So I'm range, I'm on team two, I'm on the bull's right hand side, Notice how big these AoEs are and how we have to hug the, the, the edges of these circles in order to survive the AoE. Check out the melee. Very little area to stand in, but the healers are always directly in front um, of the ranges, right behind the tanks. You want to align yourself with those bridges if it helps. Everything blasts off, and that's, that's death. So welcome to War Harvest, a.k.a. Inu War is the strat that we're using. There's going to be one bull, two minotaurs, and two birds. The simple solution here is if whatever you're tethered to, just go to your animal and then spread out from there. If you have purple, you go to the bull and you spread out like normal. If you have a bird, you go to the bird and you pop your knockback like normal. And if you have a minotaur, you simply move away from it, either down south, or if you're up top, away from the bull. In this illustration, I'd give this a save, give it a look over, but it's the same um, as the Inu one. I just added some more color to it, but it's really easy. There's just not a whole lot of room, wiggle room, uh, to go to. So you want to make sure that you get to your spot fairly quickly. Um, the easy solve I use for this one is, again, I just look for my my bull's egg, my bull's seed, and make my way somewhere towards the middle of this map on these, on these platforms. You want to wiggle around, 
what uh, how party finder messes up is they get which animal they're tethered to confused by just being too close together and too stacked together. So again, if you have a purple tether which is tethered to the bull, run to the bull and spread out like normal. If you have if you're tethered to a bird, you're either going to be up north or down south. Hug the edge of that circle and pop your knockback right away. And if you're tethered to a minotaur, you're either going to be pointing that all the way down south or all the way to the east and west opposite of wherever your bull slash yak might be. And that's it. That's in you war. We needed LB3 here. Um, Party Finder gets it mixed up a lot because they're not paying attention to what tether they actually belong to. So wiggle around, jump around. Jumping definitely helps uh, if you're on a tiny screen. And that's it. That's all the harvests. So after the harvest, there's um, another stack marker here in the back. There's some more Elbows of Fury. Just run away from those. Some more Raid Wides. Maybe just one. But that's it. Thank you very much, everybody, for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, to my fellow Static members, hi. How's it going? Uh, thanks for watching, and I hope the slow-mo helps you. Watch it a few more times uh, for Raid Nights. And... Yeah, like, share, and subscribe, everybody. Show this with your friends, family, your grandma. It has been an honor and a pleasure serving you this afternoon. And don't forget to make yourself one of these cute little seeds. If you haven't, they're helpful for reminding you, hey, look for the seed with the circles, you know? Um, there's my Hildebrand face. I'm playing too much. Thank you, everybody, very much for watching from the bottom of my heart. My name is Maka. I will see you on the next one. Please like, share, and subscribe, and join our Discord if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. All these videos and illustrations and everything will be put under rating resources. If you need any help, just give us a holla. Maka is out. <laughs>